perhaps in our document we want to set up some sort of list where we have a whole bunch of items listed beneath each other with little bullet points off to the left. In this video, we'll look at how we can easily set that up using bulleted lists. So to turn some text into a bulleted list, let's work with some existing text. So here I already typed out a list and I've just got them spaced with a paragraph return here. So all I have to do is highlight that text I want to turn to a list, come up here to the home tab on the ribbon, and here is the bulleted list button. And I'm just going to click the bulleted list button. You can see it automatically takes them and reformats them and gives a bullet for each item in the list. Pretty easy. I can also take that list off by highlighting those same items. You can see up here my bulleted list is highlighted in gold. I'll click on it again and it simply takes that list back off. I'm going to turn my list back on here. We can simply add new items to my list by coming to the end of my last item here, pressing the enter key to go down to a new line, and here I can add in something else. If I want to go down to a new line without starting a new list, so go to start a new paragraph, I'm going to press enter once and then press enter one more time. And then you can see now I can go on and I can carry on with my paragraph. Pretty easy to do. We can also do this with lists. Okay. I can move things to different levels of my bulleted list. Let's say I want desk to be indented one more. I can put my cursor here and I can press the tab key. Tab is gonna bring it over and make it indented one. So it's the next level in the list. Okay. You can also press shift tab to take it and indent it back the other way. So that's tab and shift tab to bring it around. We can also just start a bulleted list right from scratch without having our content already typed out. I'm gonna come down here to just some blank space. I can click the bulleted list button and just start typing my list. And away I go. And again, if I press enter twice, it takes me back down and I've done my list. So there we have setting up bulleted lists. Don't forget, if you want to move an item on the list from one level to the next, you can use the tab key to move it from left to right and shift tab to move it from right to left.